having said that, I think that what is happening here is basically uh, who can watch, because I'm seeing a battle between the deputy president and the interior peers, who can watch for this intelligence report and say that this is what it was. And I think that uh, on that, it's still up there in the air. But from the recent uh, events, and I'm not talking about whether it's right or wrong, in the recent events where you have seen the public officers, which the deputy president is saying that we employed them, and that included national intelligence officers, the deputy president is saying we employed them. But in recent times, we have seen public officers uh, not allowing the deputy president to access his, uh, at least from his side, not to access his house in Mombasa. We have seen his officers being swapped. We have seen the same public officers not recognizing him uh, during uh, Madaraka Day. Going by that analogy, we have seen the public officers not inviting him to the cabinet uh, ceremony with the president before they went to the Madaraka Day. By just that analogy, Dibal, I would believe that even those who are supposed to give him those intelligence reports, if that analogy I've given is to go by, have not been giving him those intelligence. And therefore, I would go with the analogy that maybe the Kibicho one is the one which has emanated from there as opposed to the one which the deputy